Jody Arias be getting married behind bars. It's the latest rumor about the convicted killer, and tonight we are getting to the bottom of this one with an insider who is spilling how it's possible for prisoners to tie the knot. ABC 15's Joe Bartels live tonight. And Joe, what did you find out about this? Well, there would be a lot of hoops to jump through. We know Jody spent time in jail, then she got transferred to that prison out in the West Valley. But if this wedding goes off, it will be unlike anything you've ever attended. Far from any fairy tale wedding, infamous killer Jody Arias is rumored to be planning to tie the knot in prison. Weddings inside the Department of Correction happen on occasion. Former Department of Corrections insider Barrett Marson says if Arias is even allowed to get hitched, it won't be anything extravagant. There are no white gowns and there's no walk down the aisle. Uh, you get married in your orange regular prison attire. Marson says there's no rings, no cameras, and absolutely no intimacy, which brings up another point. How did she even meet someone she wants to marry behind bars? There are no conjugal visits in the Department of Corrections in Arizona. Uh, some systems may have that. Arizona certainly does not. Marson says inmates meet people through letters and phone calls, and having a baby and a family behind bars is out of the question. But that's putting the cart before the horse, as they say. You know, there's no kids, there's no happiness, there's no music, there's not a lot of those regular trappings uh, that women so look forward to preparing for a wedding. And Jody would have to apply with the Department of Corrections to even get married, and they'd have to approve it. She'd also have to apply for a marriage license. Back to you. Of course, still a rumor at this point. We'll be following it. Joe, we know you'll let us know if you hear anything. Thank you.